And new developments today in the investigation into the death of a woman in a Texas jail. Police released new video from outside Sandra Bland's cell around the time that she died. It comes as her family awaits the results of a private autopsy. ABC's Stephanie Ramos reports. Much of the debate about the death of black activist Sandra Bland at Waller County Jail in Texas comes down to what happened in this cell. Authorities say this newly released three-hour surveillance video from the jail shows the moment officers realized 28-year-old Sandra Bland was dead, hanging in her jail cell, a plastic garbage bag around her neck. This just three days after she was arrested during a traffic stop. The state trooper arrested Bland for assault of a public servant, then transported Miss Bland to the Waller County Jail. Police placed her by herself in an empty cell block. You can't see her in the surveillance video, but police claim she was doing fine. And less than three hours before her death, I authorities say jailers conducted their rounds. Later, she asked about making a phone call, one never made. It would be their last conversation with her. An hour later, a guard comes to Bland's cell. The jailer looked through the window and observed Miss Bland hanging from her privacy partition in her cell. Later in the video, you can see jail staff and EMS roll a stretcher down the hallway. This is being treated like a murder investigation. Even with this video, Bland's family says there are still many questions and few answers about her arrest and treatment. We are not satisfied with the explanation that she committed suicide. A young woman having just received a job at her alma mater is not the attitude that would suggest suicide. The Waller County, Texas District Attorney says one of the things he'll consider closely is whether there are any fingerprints other than Bland's on the trash bag that was found around her neck. In Northwest, Stephanie Ramos, ABC 7 News.